Wow, is this all that $350 bought me? <laughs> I have a Costco haul for you guys today. Um, I went to Costco, filmed a shop with me. Did you see it? I'll link it. I also bought a lot of like boxed food items. You guys know this baby's coming pretty soon. Um, I just wanted to stock up on staples in our house so that I won't have to when the baby comes. Even though, uh, if I do need to stock up, I'm thankful for services like, what are they called? They like come to your house and deliver your groceries. You know what I mean? Those kind of services. I will surely utilize them, but I also feel like when I'm postpartum, I like going grocery shopping. It's like one of the only outings that I do. Anyway, we're getting off topic. I'll show you everything that I got. Oh, and I did not hold back this time. I got the cake. Oh, that's why it doesn't look like that much. I forgot to unload one tote. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, here's the haul, kind of as a whole. I left some stuff in there and there's stuff behind the counter. Who cares, we'll get to it. I got a couple of raspberries. I also ate a bunch on the way home. No regrets, death by pesticides. I'm okay with it. I got some Jif peanut butter. Choosy moms choose Jif, but I'm pretty sure choosy moms choose all natural no ingredients added other than peanuts and maybe salt <laughs> to peanut butter, which is what I have in my cupboard. However, I find that when I make sandwiches, it like runs out and then my kids make a mess everywhere. So I love Jif and that's my story. I'm sticking to it. I also got some baby potatoes. Love those for dinner. Also love broccoli. Almost bought two bags. Regretting the, the fact that I didn't. I got some blueberries. They were an okay price, around five bucks. Bananas, apples. They didn't have green apples at Costco, so I'm gonna have to go to Publix just for some smaller items. I also am in the midst of making breakfast freezer meals, which I need a few items for. Uh, one of those items being tortillas, tortillas. I'm going to make breakfast burritos, so I need more tortillas for that. Also, great for tacos, love tacos. Oh my gosh, you guys, you know what they had? Cinnamon, do you know how much this massive container of cinnamon was? Three dollars, maybe two dollars. I don't even know, it was crazy. It blew my mind. There's, there's no way this could be like real cinnamon. I don't know, it doesn't say otherwise. I'm gonna believe Kirkland. Okay, I got a pineapple, my kids are loving that. Also got a waffle maker, not from Costco, but I did buy one, ha! You guys know I've been obsessing over my mini waffle maker, but it takes me like 20 minutes to make waffles. But with this one, it takes me like four minutes. It's insanity. So I got some fig bars. Uh, the kids are really enjoying these. I can't remember the last time I bought a box, but we had some and we got to the end of our snack pile. Like here is our pantry. It's looking real bare. Usually this is like overflowing with crap. So they ended up eating the last fig bars and they were like, hmm, these are really great. I was like, yeah, I know. Why haven't you eaten them earlier? Madre's lentils or sorry, madras? Everyone attacks me about the way I say crap. Tomato, tomato. I got some of these. They're delicious, guys. A rose by any other name. My kids love them. I love them. Easy dinner or lunch or breakfast. I don't care. Eat them for breakfast. I got a ton of chocolate chips. I don't even know how much those were. I'm not sure if they were worth it. But I do know the holidays are coming and I'm going to need a lot of these. So I just went ahead and stocked up. You guys, I bought these last time, the Philly cheesesteaks, and I wasn't sure if they were good. They weren't even on sale. They just looked good, sounded good. Oh my gosh, are they good? Yes. I'll say that. <laughs> the bread stays soft and fresh in the microwave. It does! I don't know how they do it. It is, how many are in here? Again, they weren't on sale, so it was like $11 for, oh, six sandwiches, yoink. I'll tell you what though, they're worth it. They're delicious. Mini tacos. These are just a, like an after school snack staple for us. Oh, you know what else is? Stroop waffles. Unbelievable. Yes, these were on sale. I almost didn't buy them. I walked past them the past few times I've been at Costco and this time I said, I'm buying it all. And you know what I bought? The cake. Oh my gosh. Can't wait to eat my Matilda cake. I've been talking about this for years. Actually, this one is $13. The other chocolate cake I've been talking about, I haven't seen lately, but 
First of all, you can't pass up this price. Second of all, it's freaking chocolate cake. Third of all, it's enormous. Oh, I'm gonna regret eating every single bite of this, but also am going to love every single second of it. Do you know what I mean? It's been one of those weeks and I just feel like, eat it. <laughs> just eat it, you know? I also got these, so delicious. These are one of my favorite treats. I'm gonna have to really hide these from the kids because they love them just as much. Much too good for children, I'll say that. Morning Summit, I haven't had this cereal before. I'm actually not a huge fan of cereal. However, in the mornings, I feel like I've been beat up. So that's all I've been eating in the mornings until I make all my freezer meal breakfasts, I'm sure. But this is just quick and easy and it looks really good. It has almonds, cereal flakes, dried cherries, dried cranberries, and pumpkin seeds. Uh, lightly sweetened with maple berry. Let me know if you guys have tried it. I'll let you know my thoughts if I try it before I upload this. Also, pizza snacks. Delicious, not so nutritious. Also for the kiddos after school. Ooh, you know what else is not nutritious? These. <laughs> <laughs> Heavenly hunks, they had these as a sample and they got me. They're like, oh, they're organic and gluten-free and vegan. I'm none of those things. But somehow they sold me on it because they're delicious. Especially for something that's gluten-free. What's in it even? Uh, so they've got some oats and chocolate chips and delicious stuff. Who cares? This stuff is so good. Uh, the price wasn't, it was like 10 bucks, but a wonderful treat nonetheless. I got some powdered sugar because I really wanna make, what's that, I don't even know the name of it. It's like peanut butter and powdered sugar and rice cereal topped with chocolate. It's basically like, what are those things called? Man, my brain, the Buckeyes, but in a form of a sheet cake. Oh, I think I shared the recipe with you. I'll try to find it and link it below. It is so good. It's like a holiday staple, but I'm craving it like now. I don't care if it's the holidays, obviously. <laughs> okay, so I got this last time I ran to Costco for toilet paper. I also, we had guests over that night and I was like, I have no idea what I'm gonna make. I'm running out of time. So I grabbed this and like some really easy things to throw together. These are so good. Oh my gosh, the baked scalloped potatoes. It, they're pricey and you only get like one pan of them, but holy crap, I don't know what they add in that. To make it so delicious, unicorn dust, I don't know. Smoked pulled pork, this is a staple, so delicious. And an easy dinner to throw together if you just have those Hawaiian rolls, throw that on top of it. Oh, bone apple feet. Oh gosh, you guys. Okay, my kids don't like mac and cheese. I don't really like mac and cheese. <laughs> I don't know why I was tempted to buy this, but I was. $10 for all of this, it's like catering style, it's huge. And I'm gonna eat this when I'm done with this haul. I cannot wait to eat this. Why am I craving cheese, the calcium? I eat plenty of green leafy vegetables. I don't know, but I'm excited about it nonetheless. I also ran out of my dressing, the Olive Garden dressing. This is the best dressing you'll ever eat in your entire life. You know what else? This is like a cheese haul. This is the junkiest haul I've ever had, but I'm living for it. Okay, lasagna, Ita you're like, what, Kim? Girl, do you not have enough freezer meals in your freezer? Nope, <laughs> no I don't. Um, this is like one of the best lasagnas I've ever had. You get two trays in here for the price. It's fantastic, it's cheaper than making it yourself. The regatta alone, regatta, ricotta. I can't say, I can never say that word right, who cares? You know what I mean. Uh, that alone is like six bucks if you're gonna make two lasagnas, you know what I mean? Maybe more, I don't know, I haven't made it in a long time. I have made it with tofu before, delicious. Okay, I got some gummies for the kids. They're running out and these were on sale. Smarty Pants, Vitamin C. We love Vitamin C gummies around here. Ooh, bombs away. Moving all this crap aside, oh, as if this haul wasn't filled with enough cheese. Here's a huge chunk of it. This is so much cheaper than buying the pre-shredded stuff. And a lot of you during my freezer meal prep, you're like, hey, your food processor has a little attachment Oh my gosh, you guys, I totally forgot about those stupid attachments. So I'm definitely gonna pull it out when I make my freezer meals because I'm gonna need this for like quiche and stuff like that. So I'm excited about using my shredder. Oh my gosh, you guys. <laughs> this is seriously the junkiest haul ever. 
I could not help myself. There's no holding back when I'm nine months pregnant, right? <laughs> Nutella was on sale. The price of two of these is cheaper than the price of one of them at another grocery store. It's just unbelievable. I eat this crap like pudding. I grew up on it. I love it so much. I could stare at it for hours and smell all the things. I could bathe in that. Oh my gosh. Okay, moving on to the granola bars. It's another staple. Butter, we're running out of it. I'm gonna need it when I make my waffles. Crepes and more crepes because they were on sale. I got some croissants and we haven't had these before. I mean, I've had them before when my husband and I lived in Italy, but my kids haven't had them. I can't imagine they're that delicious. <laughs> Like, you know what I mean? They're not as delicious as fresh croissants and Nutella, but I'm sure they're gonna be great. Oh my gosh, you know what else I got? This crap. Popped corn, but it's like caramel and cheese. Again, with the cheese, I don't know why I'm obsessed with it. Rich cheddar cheese corn and buttery. I bought this the first time after Kimmy from She's in Her Apron bought it, and I was like, what is the hype about? She loves it, and I bought it, and I was like, this is, stuff is amazing, <laughs> it's so good. I got a couple of these boxes of um, chips. Avelina's classroom is having like a barbecue cookout, so I signed up to bring some chips along. I probably overdid it. I don't, I couldn't remember how much I signed up to bring, so I just, I'd rather bring too many than not enough. <laughs> I got a couple cartons of eggs, some OxyClean over here. I've been loving putting this in my uh, laundry detergent. I only use one Tide Pod for a large load and then I use OxyClean. Guys, it really does make a difference. And then I got this huge roll of wrapping paper. If you watch my shop with me, you saw that I almost bought like the, they had a four pack. There are two prints on here. The cute little Santa Claus faces and then it says Merry Christmas. Um, and this is gonna last me like 17 years. And that is everything that I got in my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Costco has so many gems. And every time I go there, I wanna buy way too much. And then I have to rein it in and be like, no, Kim, don't do it. This time I went for it. I don't even care anymore. <laughs> time to eat is all I'm excited about. It's time for lunch. It's way too, it's 1.30. I need to eat lunch and then go get the kids. Okay, anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out. If you enjoyed, please subscribe, put a little more happy in your day, and I will see you next time. Bye.